Hello everybody, my name is the TFOY and welcome back, welcome to another Indie Chicago story. Mm -hmm. This time, we have In Lucy's Eyes. Now, I actually played the demo for this um, a month or two back, and um, it was pretty interesting. It was you scaring me in a way Amnesia usually doesn't scare me, so um, that looked quite interesting. And now we have the full release of the game, yay! Uh, and a music kind of story that actually works, by the way. That's why I have the continue button. I was just testing some things. But, um, yes, um, if you're here from Transformers Universe, um, welcome, I'll be here for the long haul. Um, but my uh, voice is okay, I had some audio problems with this, but... There is, a uh, one minor thing I need to, um, warn you guys about. And that is that the first area is really, really laggy. Like, it just tanks my frame rate. And you'll see what I mean. But anyways, um, how are you all doing? You doing well? Good. I also made sure I installed a clean version of Amnesia, so everything in this game should work correctly. Uh, when I last tried it out, um, I had a flashlight instead of the uh, candle, I think, due to a um, another mod that I had installed. But hopefully everything should be clear now. I... I thought he was mad. I thought I could help him. Okay. All those ominous imaginings. What were they? Hallucinations, maybe? Anna. She warned me. She had seen that thing. Seen it in Lucy. She told me about the emptiness and reluctance in her eyes. Why did I not dare to see for myself? Where did they go? Lucy, my darling, where did mommy take you? Why didn't she tell me about this? Was she taking you home? Taking you to safety? It was on the road leading away from the castle, during my desperate search for my family, that I heard it. That voice. The inviting familiarity struck my mind. I was on the wrong track. They had not fled the castle. I know where they are now. Well, let's do that. Oh, sorry. I assume we're playing as this character. Okay. Now this is... Right. Now this is what I was talking about. The frame rate is uh, pretty low here. Like, four frames per second low. But it does the job. Like I said, I did go through a little bit of this, just to test how everything worked. <sighs> Got you! Ah, excuse me. I'm allergic to pine. There's so many pine trees outside. <laughs> no. Okay. I am a little bit sick, so they're trying to mind me. Alright. So, like I said, I did do a little test reporting, so I know how to get through the first bit. And I fell over. Fantastic. Though a lot of this is familiar off the demo. Okay, now I'm actually playing, and this is my main issue with this sequence. Frame rate is really bad here. Oh, wait, I'm not actually playing. Oh, I see, a tree fell. That makes sense. Okay, that happens, and now we're into the uh, area that is pretty bad for me. So, we're gonna go this way first, because... Now here it's okay. Here I'm getting like 30 FPS. I remember reporting at 60, but once I look away at, the, at those trees over there, I get like five. So a little optimization. Thing. Right. So I went in here and there was this note. 20th of March, 1836. Bizarre things have been happening since the Baron's wife took her own life. 
I could see the unusually frequent storms tearing the reed walls of the old castle day by day and some of the people heading towards the village. When I questioned their decision, they gave me a look filled with something I can't quite understand. Strange things started happening when both the castle and the baron, they say. Soon there won't be any reason to keep guarding the bridge if the whole citadel is abandoned by its inhabitants and its workers. So that's that. Now, there was a this little area up here, but I don't think there was anything at all, or at least of importance up here. I could be entirely wrong, but I just head forward. Now, I was having some trouble before, but hopefully this should work. Um, I need this plank of wood, actually. Let me set it down. Grab it by like the end. Come on, show the little hand. There we go. Uh, rotate it so that it's like facing. Yeah, that that'll do. I look like I'm holding. I look like I have an arm for a hand. Like a first-person perspective. All right. By the way, I'm trying to run, but this frame rate isn't really helping. Just saying. The idea here is that we need to put the thing on the bridge, so... I'm gonna try to be a bit careful. Okay, yes. Oh, that's right, I get the, uh, memento. Setting you down. Journal, memento. I need to find a way to cross it, okay. So, I assume we needed this. Actually, I know we needed this because this is what I used last time. I think. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Yep. Then I get up here. Then I need to make a leap of faith onto that thing. Yep. There we go. Okay, I did it. Fantastic. Okay, this is as far as I've got. So, everything should be okay. Uh, there's a path that way and a path this way. Um, I actually remember these glowing mushrooms, and then that's where I stopped uh, just to test it out. I went through multiple settings on this game. This lag issue isn't my fault. There's just so many trees here. For some reason, the amnesia trees aren't really that optimized, in my opinion. It's over here. Boxes, boxes, boxes. Nothing of importance. So we're gonna keep heading this way. I've got about 20 frames per second. So this is manageable, manageable. But I assume once I get in the castle, everything's gonna be hunky dory. Let me in. Yay! Loading castle entrance. That's a nice drawing, by the way. I didn't compliment the drawings, but they are quite nice. They are custom made for the story. I don't know if you can see them. I hope you can. Okay. Now, now we're getting somewhere. 60 FPS. Amnesia. Fantastic. Ah, the good old amnesia sound. Hello. Oh, shit! Did that happen before? I don't remember. I just got hit in the head with the chandelier. Hmm. Oh. Well, there you go. There's your introduction in Lucy's eyes. <laughs> oh, hello, Mr. Chandelier. How are you doing today? You just bought me in the head. Thank you very much. I don't think I've ever been ki uh, killed or hurt by a chandelier in amnesia. That's new. Alright. Hope you're okay, buddy. Ah, uh, your sanity's pretty low. I need to search for clues leading to Lucy. Fair enough. Alright. Sanity's a bit low. Maybe this will help you. Boop. Okay. 
So, all right. So the question is, where do we want to go? Up there is two rooms. This is boarded up. Let's see if it's over here. I can't run. This is also boarded up. But maybe there's something here I need. No, no, no. No. Okay. Then let's head up to one of the upper areas and see what's up there. Again, don't know if it's quiet enough for you to hear my fan. I sure hope not. But everything should be okay. So let's see, we have the guest rooms, and we have library. Okay, guest room seems a good start. Loading guest rooms. Interesting. Love these drawings. Don't know if you can see them, I hope you can. Hey, if there's any other audio issues, I'll try to fix it in the next episode. Still a bit sick, so sniffling is me, so don't think that my sniffling is a monster, trust me, I I, I would know. <laughs> uh, come on, guest rooms, load faster, thank you. Okay, really? It's gonna be Actually it's not that bad. A matchbox. This could come in handy. You never know when you need it the most. Okay. There we go. This is what I was looking for. Okay. Um, I don't want to go upstairs just yet. Oh, really? That's how long they last? Alright, then I gotta be careful about it. If the game is very dark, uh, I'm sorry. Hello? You guys hear that? Hello, sir. Locked. What the? Oh, there's a door right here. Oh! Whoa, jeez, that scared me. Okay, we're good. <laughs> a note. The journey here was long, but not at all at all. I had never seen such beautiful natural vistas. Truly, this land has remained untouched by time and progress. I can only imagine what wonders lay hidden in the deep, unexplored reaches of these forests. We stopped briefly in a village on the way, and were treated with hospitality, although I felt as though we were not entirely welcome there. Speaking with the local people, one gets the idea that this region is haunted. They speak of a great massacre that occurred within recent memory. That, as far as I can tell, ended when a special sacrifice was made. How macabre. They are rather strange, the whole lot of them. They rarely leave their homes and do not seem eager to speak with outsiders. I wonder what they are so fearful of. David tells me that in small rural communities, superstitions tend to be a strong part of cultural identity and assures me that they are just carrying on the same way their ancestors have for centuries. But I'm not entirely certain. Interesting. So I assume I'm David. Uh, I can't do anything with that lockpick. Oh, that was the, uh, things. It is dark, I must say. I wonder if there's more matches around here. Yeah, I really hope so. Part of me is trying to remember this from the demo. I haven't looked back at it. Oh, hello. Four matches. Perfect. These long, dark hallways really aren't that great. Oh, hello. 
Oh, my frame rate's taking again. Nice campfire. Oh, that doesn't look ominous. Hmm. I think I remember this from the demo. Yeah, there was something in here that I needed. Um, okay. Yeah, okay, I remember this. Um, I'm trapped in here. I need to get something. <coughs> yeah, I need that hammer. Five matches. Two matches. Okay. Okay, that's fine. I'm guessing all I came was for that. Door stay open. Oh, jeez, I'm still dying. Oh, this hammer makes me go so slow. Come on. Oh, there's something to my left. Okay. No, come on. I need that. Can you throw it? There we go. Oh, the hinges. That's right. Come on. <coughs> Can you just bang that off? There we go. Jeez. Let me out. Okay. How am I doing? Uh, a few cuts and bruises. Crystal clear. I got sanity. And... Bunch of matchboxes. <laughs> matchboxes as in the cars, no I'm kidding. I should have said just matches. Oh, that's water. Okay. Is this anything? I think it was. Hello? No. Alright, ten matches left. Okay, that's Apparently they really don't want me to go there. Mementos. Someone blocked the stairs. I need to find another way up. up. Fair enough. What is this? This is all coming back to me slowly. Nine matches. Okay, this is just the same hallway. Perfect. I'm trying to remember, but I can't. Locked. Oh, this is just a dead end. As it matches. Three. Nothing behind the piano. Okay, I'm actually running over time. Um, no, okay. Anyways, that's in Lucy's eyes. Hope you guys are. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, stay tuned for the next episode tomorrow. And stream. <laughs>